Manually separating hundreds of scrap tyres from wheel rims can be a long, inefficient and back-breaking process, typically taking a dismantler several minutes per wheel. Whereas Auto Drain's revolutionary wheel popper separates scrap wheels and tyres in no time at all. What's more, the wheel popper can process steel, alloy, light commercial and 4x4 wheels and its robust all-steel construction ensures low maintenance costs and a long service life. The wheel popper is a very powerful machine, so it's important that you familiarise yourself with the instructions before commencing any operation. All wheel popper machines are preset and require no adjustment by the operator. To use the wheel popper, first depressurize the tyre and then position the wheel correctly on the machine. This can be done easily by matching the size of the wheel with the appropriate settings on the adjustable plate. This ensures that the tyre is separated from the rim without damage to the wheel popper ram. Line up the wheel popper ram so that it's positioned above the wheel rim and position the tyre slightly underneath the wheel popper clamp. Before switching on the wheel popper, make sure that no one else is within 3 metres of the machine and maintain vigilance throughout the entire operation. With your right hand, pull the dead man's handle. Then, with your left hand, operate the hydraulic control to lower the clamp until the tyre is tightly held in the jaws of the clamp. Whilst maintaining hold of the dead man's handle, with your left hand, operate the hydraulic control to lower the pushing ram. And keep a careful watch as the ram pushes down onto the wheel rim and separates it from the tyre. Ensure that the pushing ram does not touch the side of the wheel at any point during the operation. Next, use the hydraulic control in the opposite direction to withdraw the wheel popper ram and clamp. Now retrieve the separated wheel and tyre and remove them to a safe storage area. Repeat the process as necessary. Separating a tyre from an alloy wheel is slightly different from a steel wheel. You'll still need to match the size of the wheel with the appropriate settings on the adjustable plate. But once you start the procedure, take things more slowly as alloy wheels are brittle compared to steel wheels and are prone to cracking. Sometimes you will need to make adjustments and reposition the wheel on the machine before continuing with the operation. The wheel popper alloy spoke pusher attachment can be a useful aid in the process of separating alloy wheels from tyres. Please note, this is an optional extra. The wheel popper separates light commercial and 4x4 wheels in the same efficient manner. The wheel popper is designed to minimise the need for bending and stretching, so you'll find the wheel lifter a useful accessory, further reducing operator fatigue and risk of injury. Whilst every wheel popper comes with a safety guard fitted as standard, there is an option to have the big guard fitted instead. Please note, both the wheel lifter and big guard are optional extras and are sold separately. Guidance on routine cleaning, maintenance and servicing can be found in the manufacturer's instructions. There are electric, petrol and diesel wheel popper machines available, all easily movable by forklift truck. What's more, its compact design allows the wheel popper to be located in the depollution bay to make best use of working space.